Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to an undisclosed marsh. I am in the middle of nowhere. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a back lake over there. That's what I'm headed to. I just saw what was probably an overslot red. He was just sitting here in this little area eating. So that makes me feel really good about this, this long trek to the back lake. Cause I'm hoping they're gonna be back there just stacked up. I got my best friend out here fishing with me today. His name is Jasper. He's, hey Jasper, hey, say hi. He's just back there in the tank well, enjoying the free ride, waiting for a redfish. All right, people, I got my first redfish on the fly here, and I forgot to have my my record my camera going. But it's a beauty, and it is pulling some. Dry. I've all, it's almost got me in the backing. Oh my God, this will be the first one to get me in the backing if it does. I'm not gonna let it do it easy though. It's gonna have to make it me do it if it wants to do it. Oh, I think I'm getting line back now. We got it over there. Oh, nope, I think I'm gonna get it. I don't think this is gonna be the one to get me in the backing. Not today. Come on in, big boy. <laughs> look, at, look at Jasper, he's curious too, he sees that wake. He's like, what do we got, Dad, what do we got? I saw a couple sitting here, so I pulled up to this creek and I spooked the first one, but then I saw this guy coming down the shoreline, so I decided to just wait him out. Oh yeah, that's a beauty. I got him on a, a fly that my buddy Andrew tied for me. Okay, as soon as I get him all played out, I'll I'll do the little the little fly rod trick to land him. I don't want to I don't want to handline him until he's ready though. Let's see when he gets about here. Come on, fish. I know you're about done. Okay. Then I'll give him a little extra slack here. And then try to catch my line. There we go. And then I'll just try to hand line him in. Very carefully. That is a big old redfish, people. <laughs> Jasper. You don't even know what that is. That's a redfish, Jasper. That's a big one. Too big to keep, I'm sure. Okay, let's get the brogas out. They're not bogas, people. They're just, they're like knock. Okay, Jasper, go back there and sit down. They're, oh, sorry about that, redfish. They're like knockoff bogas. They're called brogas. And they're 15 bucks at the tackle shop. And, oh, let me get that butt off your butt or your tail. 15 bucks at the tackle box in Victoria. That's where I got mine. Wow, people, what a fish. That is a beauty. Get a quick measurement just so I know what I was dealing with here. Look at that perfect corner of the mouse hook set. I love it, people. Fly fishing is where it's where it's at. Look, there's some more reds right there. Look, I can see two more right there coming at me. Okay, fish. All right, let me get you on the bump board and then I'll let you go. I, I told people I would measure you, so I'm going to do it. But I'm watching those other reds over there right now. Okay, come on, big boy. Come on, get up here. Straighten out. Stop it. Okay, thank you. 26 and a half inches, people. 26 and a half. That is a beautiful redfish. You ready to go? There he goes. Don't go tell your buddies about me and that little fake shrimp I'm throwing. Thank you, Andrew, for the for the shrimp fly. I want to catch another couple on that, but then I'm gonna go probably switch up to one of my flies that I tied myself. We got a couple coming this way, people. Oh, he's on, nice. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Okay, good. <laughs> Freaking nodding my line. Out of my basket. All right, he's on the reel, people. He's on the reel. All right, I, I knew if I just sat here and waited, eventually they'd come around this corner. 
looking for bait. I wasn't having a lot of luck because they kept spooking when I get close to them. This tactic worked, paid off. Only stood here for about five minutes. Oh, this guy's got some fight. He don't want to pull a lot of drag, but he don't want to give it up either. I need to crank my freaking drag down a little bit, by the way. About to there. There we go. He's swimming back to me. He's gonna make it easy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This will be my second one for the day, people. I got you, I got you, I got you. Come on, let's hand line you in here. Come on, big boy. Come on, big boy. <laughs> Jasper, you need to sit down. Hey, I said sit down. How's it going, redfish? Can I fool you with that with that shrimp? Shrimp fly. Okay, let me go ahead and put some bogus in your mouth. I'll handle you that way. I don't feel confident picking you up with that tippet. Very nice. Ain't that a beauty? All right, this is a big one, Jasper. How big do you think he is? You don't know how to measure stuff? All right, I understand. Let's see. 24 inches on the money. That sets you free, buddy. You get to go 24 inches. If you were 23 or under, you'd be on the stringer today. But it's your lucky day. There you go. Look at all those shrimp popping out of the water, people. Pop, 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 just right down his wake. Shrimp just popping. I don't know if you can see it on the GoPro, but. Nice, got him. All right, <laughs> he's in this tiny little channel. Oop, there goes another one. It's like my little crab fly worked, people. I tied this crab myself. Stay off my stringer. No, oh, no, 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 stay off my rudder too. Oh no, he's on the rudder, he's on the rudder. Come on, get off the fucking rudder. <laughs> Shit. There we go. Okay, let's get him back over here now. Oh, fish, come back. Come back, fish. What a fight. What a fighter. <laughs> His little tiny channel's not making it any easier for him either. I'm worried he's gonna get over there and get around that wood. Okay, fish, I got you now. Sit down. There he is. <laughs> there goes a mullet. We've got a lot of mullet in here. All right. Looks like your goose is cooked, Mr. Fish. 
You ready to come back in? Come on in here. Whoa, 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 that's a big guy. Oh, look at that beast. Took that crab fly that I tied and ate it. I love it. What a beautiful fish. That, see that crab? <laughs> nice. <laughs> Look at that. That's another big old redfish right there. Whew, just took off. He lifted my kayak up a little bit when he went under it. Oh, there goes another one. Looks like I got one redfish I'm trying to get around right here. This thing is loaded up with freaking mullet and shrimp and redfish. Look at this guy. He did, he did not need to eat because he is full but he decided he was going to put it somewhere I guess we got a, another big redfish coming at us right now alright fish let me get you off this hook oh I got a volunteer mullet <laughs> did you people see that <laughs> volunteer mullet just popped up through the floor of my kayak start flipping and flopping nowhere there we go got him out look at that fly people that's a crab fly if I ever saw one he wants to see how long this guy is before I let him go whoa fish or bump board look here comes another one out of that twenty three Got him. Nice. <laughs> this one's a little guy here. I might be able to just horse him in. <laughs> Get some reds in the marsh on the fly, people. Barely enough room to cast this thing. The question though, is this gonna be a slot red? See if I can get in real quick. And got him. Whoa, don't get tangled up on all the line. My crab fly worked again, people. Right in the corner of the mouth. Beautiful. Beautiful hookup. Look at that old crab. Look at those red eyes and everything. I'm proud of that. I, I made that myself, people. It's a special kind of feeling when you're catching reds on a fly or lure that you made yourself. This guy is not legal. He is 19 and a half inches long. I was hoping you'd be right at 20, buddy, because I was going to put you on the stringer. I've already got a limit today, but I've only got two on the stringer because 
I didn't want to keep a bunch of big, big reds, and I've been catching big reds today. Here we go. All right, buddy. I forgot to get a picture of that one, but he was undersized anyway, so it's all good. Sight casting reds in the marsh on the fly.